quick video to show you how to add another language to your Windows keyboard. I'm going to show you the old school way through control panel. At the end I'll show you how to get there with the new Windows 10 way. Search for and launch control panel. We're going to use language options. If you don't see it, change your view by to small icons, open language, click on add a language, search for the language, select, click on open to see all the dialects, select one, click on add. To move it to your default, select it and move it up. Note that if it's your default, if it's the first one, you can't delete it. To see the keyboard layout for that language, click on Options and Preview. See, these are some of the special characters for this particular language. Click on Close. And you can also install a language pack. Now take a look down here in System Tray. If you don't see the language indicator that allows you to switch back and forth, click on Language, Advanced Settings, and under Switching and Input Methods, click on Change Language Bar Hotkeys. In some versions, you may have to click Options to get there. Click on the Language Bar tab. Make sure your language bar settings are set to docked in the taskbar, not floating or hidden. Click on OK. Now you can just change your language here. But the fastest way, keep an eye on that where it says ENG, I'm going to press down the Windows key and the space bar. Just switches back and forth very quickly. Ah. So that's the fastest way to switch Windows and Spacebar. And if you want more language options, you can go to Language Preferences. Take a look at all your settings there. Now, if you want to do the new way, just type language, go to the same place we just were actually, and you can add a language from there. It's very similar and then choose the dialect and continue on. So I hope this is helpful to get you started. Thank you so much.